All right, you little bastards. Here's my pro tip on vehicle and anything mechanical maintenance. Right here. Yama Lube, Yama Shield, rust and cor uh, corrosion protection. You try and say that. I went to public school. I'm lucky I can barely speak me, me English, my American. Not even English, it's American. Uh, this replaces Yama Lube protectant, whatever. It's extremely flammable. Da, 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 da. All right, what is the point of this crap? This is actually made for outboard motors in the salinic salt environment, the corrosive, the horrible salt environment, which destroys absolutely everything it touches. You basically spray down the components on the outboard uh, movable parts. You can even do electronic components, plugs. It uh, protects them all. It doesn't hurt anything. It doesn't eat through the cables. It is a protectant. It is a rust and corrosion protection. Anyway, having used this on boats, I use it on cars down here in the salt air. I go under here. I do all the joints, the ball joints, the tie rods, the suspension, all that stuff, the shocks, the steering knuckle, everything gets sprayed down, even some of the wires, man, just to keep any of the uh, corrosion to occur on the cables. I do the whole undercarriage on my vehicles as well. I just did my Tacoma, which, you know, again, it starts rusting on some stuff and some, you know, uh, drain plugs and that, uh, just bolts and hose clamps, uh, plugs. I just spray it down, man, and uh, it will definitely help preserve the life of your vehicle again a little little dabble do you big daddies uh 10 bucks for a can i get this at parts vu.com again no affiliation but that's where i get it it's discounted there uh, i get a case of it about I, I think i have oh my god i have a i think i have 12 coming but i just did the golf cart here this is a lithium ion golf cart this thing hauls but 35 miles an hour it is something to get, and you can drive them down here on the streets. Yeah, you don't need a car. If you don't need a car, don't have a car. Cars are the biggest waste of money, unless you know how to maintain them yourself. As I did in a video, mentioned in a video last night, those that can work with their arms, those that can work with their hands, those that can work with their brain, mostly uh, using their hands, will do fine in the upcoming economic collapse. Things are going to collapse hugely, folks. It ain't no joke. There are no jobs. AI is replacing uh, a lot of the jobs. Robots are replacing a lot of the jobs. But, you know, things are so expensive, people cannot afford cars. As mentioned, 90000 bucks for a crappy Ford and GM pickup truck that's going to fall apart in like three years. Come on, they do fall apart. Do, look at the numbers. Chevys and mostly Dodges fall apart after three years, and you're putting all the money into maintaining them. But a lot of people are keeping their cars. Oh, keeping their cars. Our cars are 12 years old, and my truck Tacoma is 8 years old. So the point is, if you can work with your hands, do general maintenance. Even crap like this preserves your vehicles. If you can rotate tires, even on a golf cart. If you can change fluids, oil. Uh, even fill up the freaking windshield wipers. Change wiper blades. Uh, hardest part on some of this crap is finding the right parts, the right filters. Once you get that, bookmark the hell out of it. Take photos of the part number, and it'll make your life easy. Down the road, put the save the boxes, the oil filters and fuel filters come in, and uh, you'll be good to go. Because looking up that crap is what takes time. I do maintenance on um, Yamahas, Mercury Outboards, different model years, different horsepowers. And uh, what I do is I have a spreadsheet and I take pictures of everything and I put part numbers down. I put links to the store where I purchase everything on kits, individual part number breakouts. It saves you hugely. Is that a word? It saves you an immense amount of time that you can just go click, verify what you're going to buy. Click and verify what you're going to buy and then done. It gets shipped to you. So that is the, that's the secret sauce right there. Um, other things, like I said, what else can you do? Uh, like I said, oil, tires, keeping the right tire inflation is not hard. Go buy yourself a little $30 Ryobi compressor with the tire readout built into it. Boom, you're done. Easy button. Check your tires once a month. 
Uh, if your climate changes from cold to hot, seasonal, check them because the air will the pressure will change in the tires. Little crap like that just to keep your vehicles going. The lube goes a long way too, man. I'm sorry, it does. It makes, you know, it takes away the squeaks and that, makes the handling, especially on this cart, a lot easier and turning, steering. And uh, other things like that. I'm trying to think what else I can do with this. But that's pretty much it. Uh, what else is going on? Uh, anyway, just want to show you the secret sauce. Five minutes in, go check it out. Again, I buy it. Just do Yama Lube, Yama Shield. Look up, find your best price. Buying in bulk saves you money. But <clears throat> one can will do another carriage of a car. So why not buy six? Go to partsvu.com or our Amazon. I hate Amazon with a passion. I did cancel my Prime because it's just not worth it. When you spend thirty-five bucks anyway, you still get free shipping. And Prime never really even guarantees you the two-day shipping anyway anymore. It's all a scam. Schemes and scams by the uh, super Dr. Evil bald guy, Bezos. Uh, so watch that crap. They're trying to get you money. Again, as I always say, the money they make for you, the real money of these businesses is in memberships and subscriptions. That's where they get you. They're hoping you forget about it. They're hoping you forget about the perks you originally signed up for that slowly get turned off over time, like credit card rewards and stuff. Uh, two-day shipping, Prime Video now. They have commercials in their videos. It's like, bull crap, I'm done with Prime. It is canceled. I can still get free shipping when I spend over 35 bucks. And most times I can get the stuff cheaper through Costco or Walmart online. So, you know, Amazon is not all that. With everything, companies go out of business and they may be next. You never know. All right, that's all I got. Go forward, do great things. Check it out. Let me know what you think. And I'll even put it upside down for those people who can't read right. There you go. How's that? Woo! All right. Go forth. I'm out of here. I'm just babbling now. Let's put a picture of it. I'm going to, even though the country's in dire straits with the uh, current criminals running, the, running Washington, both parties, it's a uniparty. Yay! I'll still hang my flag up. All right. Go forth, do great things.